You guys remember Onager, right? He's the guy that has the quad Skogel for Dragon's V12 team with the Delphoi. I don't know if you are ready for what we're about to see today. He told me... Uh, what did he tell me? I have to find where he told me. Um, it's also possible to use five Skogels in several... There too? Okay, we're gonna use five Skogels. We're gonna, <laughs> we're gonna see what happens. Five Skogels... Oh, he already has a team. Perfect. He was ready for me. I didn't put this team in here. He was apparently farming it with this team or something. I don't know. Five Skogels. There's a few places we're going to see five Skogels today. Okay. Let's see. Five Skogels versus, uh, fantastic, versus Giants. I feel like five Skogels versus Giants isn't that crazy, right? They have element advantage. They're tanky. They have vampire. I feel like it's not that insane. We'll see. I don't believe that these five Skogels can actually do the other content that he says. But maybe we'll be uh, pleasantly surprised. That is going to be interesting. Okay. And we poop it down. It's not even doing it that slow. You can't beat Skogel. It's... Well, I mean, Tricaru would beg to differ, but... I don't know. Which one's more OP? Tricaru or... Uh, <laughs> Triple Ikaru? Or, uh, Skogels. Skogel nonsense. Oh my god. You blew all of your stones right now. Oh, he's- oh, it's targeting the, uh, the right tower first. Okay. For all those decrease attack ages. Right. Makes sense. Decrease attack age, decrease attack age. Oh, resistance. Didn't even land at that time. Okay. Oh, you know what? <laughs> okay, well, I mean, it did some damage. Uh, defense breaks are already off, though. That's not bad. That one Skogel's looking pretty, uh... Looking pretty shady. He's looking like he took a decent amount of damage, though. So, still not dead. Still not dead. Okay. Still not dead. Ooh, man, it's 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 looking rough. Is this actually gonna do it? I mean, I guess it is actually gonna do it. We're down to three Skogels, guys. We're down to three Skogels. Can three Skogels actually do this? Skogel, I mean, Skogel didn't die, so uh, possibly. As soon as we get that that right tower down. Oof. Okay. As soon as we get that right tower down. Three Skogels still left. Okay, so he's going for the left tower now. Still not dead. <laughs> still not dead. Okay. I am now a believer in the power of Quad Skogel. I mean, sorry, sorry, sorry. Qu not Squad. Uh, quintuple Skogel. I don't know why I kept saying Quad. It's definitely Quintuple Skogel. Uh, wow. Okay, so. Um, so I just watched that. So the next crazy thing we're about to see is Qu uh, sorry, not Quad, Quintuple Skogel versus Punisher Script B10. I don't know if I believe that this is actually going to work. They have 100% resistance, so maybe this is what really does it. Um, this should be interesting. I don't know if he's going to do uh, maybe target one of the towers first, though. Look at that. All those defense breaks are still tanky enough to survive everything. Quintuple Skogel. If you are not a believer of Quintuple Skogel, then uh, I, I don't know what to tell you, man. All right. Oh, did did a decent amount of damage, but still this guy's uh, still this guy's up. So okay, more Atlas stones, more defense breaks, which uh, they'll either not take or survive. Yeah, so a couple defense breaks. We've got three defense breaks on us. Hopefully, it just does... Ah, I was hoping they were just going to do skill one. <laughs> okay. He goes for the left tower first. I see. This is... I don't know if I... I don't know, man. This is really going to work? Who am I asking? I don't know who I'm asking. He said it works. So I, I must have faith in the five Skogels. That's a lot of damage, though. That's a lot of damage. Getting resisted. I think the Skogel in the middle is gonna... Gonna bite the dust. I don't know. 
Uh, they're gonna reduce their cooldowns though. Scoble in the middle is gonna. He's he's gonna bite the dust. No, he's not gonna bite the dust. He bit no dust. Okay, it's the power of uh crazy runes. Hold on, guys. Hold on. Hold on. This Skogel is about to uh, blast this PC-10 boss, Ancient Punisher. Oh, this is nice. Wow. I did not think, I did not think in a million years I would see Skogel do that two minute, two minute team. I did not think I was going to see that today, but <laughs> okay. Uh, trip, uh, sorry, Quintuple Skogel. I don't know if he's keeping that. It doesn't seem like a Skogel rune, so I don't know if he would necessarily keep that one. Um, Quintuple Skogel, uh, Punisher Script B10. He says he can clear TOA hard 100. I don't know if I, I mean, I don't know if I believe this, but we've already seen it clear Punisher Script, which I didn't think that was going to work either. I was like, I figured Giants, okay, of course, uh, it'll clear Giants. It's something will happen, no worries. It's got element advantage. Uh, we've seen crazier things, right? So I figured Giants was gonna work. Punisher script, I didn't think was gonna work. Um, TOA hard, uh, not TOA hard. We can't do TOA hard. Uh, TOA 100. I guess we'll, uh, I guess we'll find out. I mean, this is gonna be interesting to see. So they got the, nothing died from that first wave because they got the shield, right? Shield, shield. And then, uh, the Succubus has some increased cool times, but we also have decreased cool times when they're attacked, when they have the rock in the air. So it kind of is a trade-off a little bit. Um, so we'll see. This is not going to be a fast uh, first wave, though. That's for sure. Not going to be a fast first wave. They're, they're healing, too, which is not, uh, not great. But, yeah, not going to be a fast first wave, but I think they can get past the first wave. It seems like they're... Uh, well, I mean, I guess they can get past everything, but, yeah. I opened the Pandora's box of uh, all these crazy teams. I'm not complaining, I'm just saying Pandora's box open. Okay, so now they have some more uh, shields, some more crit resist. Crit resist doesn't matter against these though. Oh my god, okay, we're got okay, we got the we got the one on the right hand side down. So that just means all these rocks are gonna do more damage now. Oh, okay. And you throw all of your rocks up. Fantastic. Uh, yeah, that's just overkill. Now we don't have any rocks, buddy. These guys throw all their rocks up the, the, the last wave. They don't have any rocks now. Got a defense break. How is this going to work? Defense break, defense break, defense break. They nuke the thing that doesn't have the defense breaks. I'm not sure why. Oh, that's right. Comp to us didn't program AI. <laughs> that's, that's actually why. Okay. Um... This is going to be not so great for this Skogel, though, because uh, he's taking a lot of damage. Although he's going to have that defense break off in a second, so that's nice. So at least he'll survive there. But I don't think this second Skogel is going to last until this uh, last wave. Is that actually good? Well, maybe, maybe it will. Maybe it will. I just feel like he's going to die now. Is that going to... I mean, it, w it would be great if it kills all of them at the same time. Will it? Okay, that's not bad. Does he have trade? Or no? Oh, nice. Okay. So, all Skogels did... Actually, let's do uh, Let's do this one. Let's do the left crystal. Because left crystal has a heal block. So, I feel... I, I figure that the heal block is going to be dangerous. So, we may want to decrease the attack gauge of the unit that is going to heal block. Alright. That's at least the game plan. So... All right, so everything's basically... Uh, the Scoble's going to be, yep, pretty high on HP soon. Boss is down like a third of the way. Almost a halfway now, boss is down. Okay. Boss is down to almost... Yeah, boss is down to halfway now. All five Scoble's still alive. All five Scoble's still alive. This one Scoble, this Scoble is definitely dead now. Right? The skull. Never mind, he's not dead! Okay. What am I watching? The skull is not even dying! <sighs> this is ridiculous! I love this! I love that it's ridiculous! I'm not complaining that it's ridiculous. It's definitely ridiculous, though. 
This is the. This is so crazy. What a great, what a great community we have. Five Skogel teams. Nice. Five Skogel teams. Uh, triple Miyang with uh, three runes each. Dragon three twelve teams. This was a fantastic idea on my part. I'm a, I'm a, a pat myself on the shoulder for this amazing idea of bringing together all these wacky teams. Uh, this is nuts. Uh, very. I mean, job well done on the crazy Skogel nonsense, uh, Oniger. Very cool. So these are the runes on the Skogels. Um, they are just all, these are the runes on them. Everything is high resistance, high resistance, high resistance. Um, the runes are all vampire. This one we weren't using though. This is just triple HP. Uh, everything's on mostly vampire though. Well, the ones that we're using are on vampire, but uh, yeah. Well, we also we also showed it in the other video too. But anyway, um, should we just show real quick the uh, the runes, just in case someone wants to slow it down? But we showed them in the other video, but just so that you guys can see a little bit of if you are interested in what is if you're like I need to build a Skogel team. Clearly, Tricaru isn't the team that beats everything. It's a uh, quintuple Skogel. Well, that one we didn't even use, but. Uh, and then this one. Boom, 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 boom. Didn't think I was going to see Quintuple Skogel uh, TOA 100 today. Anyway, that's it for this one. Uh, again, thank you to Onager. Uh, very cool. <laughs> Skogel everything. Uh, good job with your... Uh, he, this is... this. He, sh he needs to be known for the Skogels now. If he's not already known for the Skogel... Oh, damn. Um, yeah, this is Mr... Officially Mr. Scogel. Anyway, that's it for this one. I'll see you as always. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you as always in the next one.